Hi, my name is JR Tallman, and in this NetSuite tutorial, I'm going to walk you through one of the new features NetSuite released in the latest release, 2025.2, which is Active Sessions. This feature lets you have multiple instances open across browsers and devices. In addition, you can be in the same role or multiple roles across these browsers and devices. To show you how this works, I am currently logged in to my development account as an administrator, as you can see in the top right hand corner of the page. I am currently using Firefox. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to log into the same account using Chrome, and NetSuite will allow me to access both my current Firefox session as well as my new Chrome session. Previously, what would happen is this page that you would see on the screen it would become inline or disabled, it'd become grayed out, and I can only log in through my new session that I just logged in with. So I'm going to log in through Chrome. And now I've logged in through Chrome on the left-hand side. So the left-hand side that what you're seeing right here is Google Chrome. On the right-hand side is Firefox. Again, I'm using the same role in both of these accounts. So this is a new feature that NetSuite allows you up to three sessions at the same time. I'm using the same account here. So let's say I want to go ahead and use a different role and be logged in at the same time. NetSuite also allows the ability to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and switch this Chrome session on the left-hand side to use my accountant role. And now I've switched to the accountant role on the left-hand side in the same development account. On the right-hand side, I can still access this. It's not gonna be grayed out. I can re refresh this page. I can do really anything inside of NetSuite here, and it's not gonna be disabling me from accessing the environment. Now, as part of this new feature within NetSuite, if I go back to my Firefox browser, and I navigate to the settings portlet on my home dashboard, there is a new field that is gonna be active sessions. So if you go ahead and click on that, active sessions field, it will take you to this active sessions page. And now you can see on my screen, it says you have two active sessions. Remember, I was not using Chrome and what I'm currently using is Firefox. So I have two active sessions that I can continuously work in. If I have a mobile browser, I can certainly use that and this would go up to three active sessions. If you want to invalidate those other sessions that are active, what you can simply do is click invalidate other sessions. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you back Chrome here. And right now in Chrome, I am in administrator. I can go ahead and refresh this. I can go to activities, whatever page that I want to be on. Again, I have two active sessions here. Now, if I go and click on inactivate other sessions, what's going to happen is this on the left-hand side is going to be inactivated. So I'm going to go and click on inactivate other sessions. And if I go and click on home here, you're going to see NetSuite takes me to back to the login page. So it has inactivated it, and now I have one active session. So this is helpful, especially if users are working across multiple environments or devices. This concludes the tutorial on how to have active sessions within NetSuite. Please like, subscribe, and comment if you have additional questions. Thank you.